Hello, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Patty, how you doing? You already on here ready? Patty, I am getting ready to cook some spaghetti this early this morning. Yes, spaghetti. As you know, me and Dana are both night owls. And so I'm going to make enough spaghetti so my kids will be able to have lunch tomorrow. And spaghetti for me and my... Huh? Oh, yeah, I'm saying tomorrow. Oh, Y'all, I'm saying tomorrow and it's right here. What's up, Key? What's up? How you doing? You back already? So what I'm doing here, y'all, I'm just chopping bell pepper and onion. I have bell pepper and onion here. Y'all see this? Bell pepper and onion. So I'm going to sit here and I'm going to chop bell pepper and onion. Yeah, I'm going to talk with you guys. I usually use spaghetti sauce, but tonight I didn't have any. I had no spaghetti sauce, guys. How you going to make spaghetti without spaghetti sauce, right? So what I had to do is I had to go pull out my old fashioned. I had to I got to make my own sauce tonight, guys. I got to use tomato paste, and I have to make my own spaghetti sauce tonight, guys. I didn't want to do that, but hey, I'm going to do it because I love spaghetti. If it if it uh usually if it's anything I would make me a cheeseburger, but I rather have spaghetti. I don't know why. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna cut this onion. I'm gonna start cutting these bell peppers first. Y'all, I have me, I have my knife right here, a big long knife. As y'all can see, I got my onions right here. I'm gonna be cutting three small onions because I didn't have any big ones. I usually like to just buy a couple big ones to be done. What's going on, Mr. Random? You up in here tonight? You like you like plenty of onions. <laughs> Random say he like plenty of onions. Hey, Sister Doorbell. Hey, Sister Doorbell, how you doing? You up in here? Yeah, so. Yeah, I like these knives. These are, I don't know if you ever used this brand before, but it's Cutco. It's actually a really, really good brand of knife. You can actually cut through yourself if you don't be very, very careful. So I really try to be very careful. I guess, y'all, I'm going to start doing this since I always cook after the lives anyway. Hey, mother and son, how you doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. So I'm going to start uh, doing these lives afterwards because it's... I mean, I don't be doing it anyways. We just be sitting here afterwards, and I usually go ahead and cook cook afterwards anyways. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just cutting this bell pepper and talking to you guys. What do you guys uh what you guys have for dinner? This is our dinner slash breakfast. Yes, thank you, Patty. Everyone, please thumbs up the live. I appreciate that. Thank you guys so much. Very, very much. I think this weekend, guys, I'm going to make some greens. I'm going to do a green tutorial this weekend. Well, there ain't no thing to it. I'm going to do a green tutorial this weekend. I'm going to do some, I don't know, probably mustards and turnips. i really been craving greens. And this weekend, I should have the time to do it. To actually sit down and do them. I haven't had too much time lately. You shall know with my mother in law, but yes, yeah, so I'm going to take the time this weekend and I'm going to do those greens. Give me some smoke. You say you had a Pico Di Iago burger? Lord, that was yesterday, canned pinto beans, but I wanted some of them, some, some of them beastie dirty cabbage. That's what you want? Lord, Lord, Lord. I forgot, Sister Dorabeth, you, you had poke. Lord, Mr. Randall, you like poke? Sister Dorabeth, you like poke? I mean, Mr. Randall, you like poke, Lord? I want to do Mr. Randall like poke, Lord. He said, I love your kitchen. Very nice. Thank you. I actually want a bigger kitchen, though, guys. I would love to have a bigger kitchen. Like a big, huge kitchen with an island in the middle. Like, that would be love. I would love that. That would be like a dream kitchen for me. Just because I love to cook so much. I'm actually taking my time in doing this right now. Because I, I actually enjoy cutting vegetables. So, and I always use all fresh vegetables and everything. I know everybody like, oh, well, you can use the frozen stuff. The frozen stuff is just as good. But I always use fresh. I just do. I've always used fresh vegetables. Like always. It's just always been. Well, not always. 
Me and my, when I was younger, I didn't, when I first started off, my mom uses like frozen vegetables all the time. But when I got older, when I got older and me and my wife started cooking, and doing all the cooking, we always do fresh vegetables. So it literally like for the holidays, it, it usually takes me like um, probably about, uh, it usually takes about two hours to cut up vegetables on the, over the holidays. Cause I have to cut them up for so many different dishes. So yeah, I usually cut a nice amount of stuff. You say yes, you eat a little poke. You eat a little poke? No, not that type of poke. I'm talking about poke salad, Lord. Poke salad. Poke weed. Yes, huh? He said, well, "Who does your dress?" Uh, uh. No, Lord, Lord, no! I was about to say his name. The person who does my dress, she's walking in here right now, and that's Dana. Does my dress? Uh, King XL. Oh yeah, yeah. I do. Yeah. I know, King. Yeah. I thought you forgot for a minute, John. No, I was about to call his real name. Oh, okay. This week is on the weekend. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm not gonna be the camera because Joe's the show tonight. If you want to be in the camera, you're very welcome to. I just want to say hello to everybody. Hey. I'm going to get my crab on, guys. I'm going to just slice it up a veggie. Everybody say hi. Hey, everybody Dan. say hey. Hey, everybody. Hello again. <laughs> How y'all doing? I'm it feels like I just seen y'all a few minutes ago. I know. Just a few minutes ago. Yeah. Oh, I love you too, sister Dorbeth. I love you so much. I'm over here working on a toilet paper doll. Yes, she is. Doing quite well, too, for her first time. Yeah, it's my first time, guys. <sighs> I'm doing this for a special person, so. Yeah, she's going to love it. Let's see. Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, I love to cook. I really love it. I get joy out of cooking, like, literally. My wife be like, babe, you don't even got to cook today. Like, why would you cook today? Like, you don't got to. Or sometimes I cook twice. I cook dinner twice in a day. I did it the other day. For the kids. You for the kids. For kids. I wanted the kids to eat some. And also, I wanted to cook on Pink Motivations channel. So I went over there and cooked with them. They do like a cooking segment on Mondays. And sometimes I go over there. And uh, cook with them on Mondays. Since Dora Bev, I would like to do something like that with you, me and Mama's Touch. Gonna be doing something like that soon. If you want to join in, and we can, what we could do is we could flip flop from each other, pick a day we all can do it, and we could flip back and forth from each other's channels. Wow. And uh, do it like that, and just kind of make it a, you know, where we both, where we uh. Everybody get watch time. Everybody get watch time. That's what I would like to do. Yeah. I don't mind I don't mind going on nobody's channel and cook at all, but I would like to make it where we all yeah. are getting exposure. Yes. Hey Mr. Random Uncle Nephew. <laughs> Everybody, all your family. <laughs> and um you said, was my crawfish vlog sinful and nasty? No, your car, your crawfish vlog was excellent. Your crawfish. I don't, I don't like crawfish, but you did an excellent job doing it. I don't know yeah. how that was sent for a nasty. It I want to. You made me want to do something because I got some crawfish in the freezer. I'm actually going to for Dana's uh, uh birthday party we're going to have on YouTube. Mm -hmm. I'm actually going to make her a, a big crab boil I know, so for her be, birthday. So I might be doing some, uh, what's it called? Mukbang. Muk yeah, banging. exactly. I'm going to do some mukbanging. Muk mm -hmm. Okay, King said, I got dread. I have dreads and needs a new position. Oh, you need a new uh, position? Oh, dude, you got dreads? Wow, Ken, I wish you was close to Indiana. I will hook you up. So that's where I saw Beast Dirty Cabbage. Oh, it looked great. Your fried chicken looked good too. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Yeah, I don't, I, uh, I actually have a cabbage video that's about to get ready to come mm -hmm. out, and I haven't released it yet. I um, my niece are releasing them. Yeah, I don't do a lot of. Uh, <sighs> yeah, it might be up tomorrow. You never know. I know. It could. Depends on how Triple C feels. I, know, I need to get it edited, y'all. Yeah. So it depends on how she feels tonight. Maybe she might do it. I don't know. 
You could edit it right now. You could. Why would you do that? Would you do that? Do that. Do that. Do what's on your own. I always got so much stuff to do, y'all. I know. What should I do? Should I just edit the video? Mm. So I can, I can, and I can work on this tomorrow during the craft day? Yeah, yeah. All right. Let me just do the video, guys. So y'all can just see this. This cabbage is going to be delicious. A lot of people want to know how we make our cabbage, guys. So let me go get this. Let me get Joe's phone so I can edit it. And uh, we have, yes, 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 this is the Rebel. Cook a dime would be nice. Yeah. Please, I'm begging you to send me a plate of that crab boil, please. King Excel, so I'm begging you to send me. Yes, yes so you can King get a you can get a plate of that get some of that crab boil. Yes, you sure can. Yes, yes, yes. I am going to actually buy her some lobster tails mm -hmm. and some crawfish and some crab. You wanna get in here? Come on in here. I get in there a little bit. Come on in here. Little taste. Come on in here. Tonight I'm the show, y'all. Okay, okay. She's a sidekick. Okay, I'll be a sidekick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. I guess so, um, so I love crab and mug. What I got going on? Oh, okay, I got a sis Gemma on here. Love you, Gemma. But I got a video. Okay, let me go ahead to the editing programs or editing software. Yeah. Um, let's see. Okay, so I love crab and muck and mud bugs. Shrimp, etc., was told that it was a sin to eat that and talk about it as a Christian. Wow, so I never, I heard, never heard of that. See, one. what's going on with those? See, 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 Lord, I love never you. heard of that one, Lord. Yeah, this kind of getting me a little upset because some, I don't yeah, know. I never heard of that one. Some people are trying to uh, discourage this door, babe. Don't, yeah, don't get discouraged. Don't get discouraged by that one. Please don't get discouraged. I never heard that one. I want to see because I was, I couldn't watch some of it, but I was in the house. I gotta go back and then I could watch it live. I had to watch the replay, but I want to see it live again. Did you make me want to do one? I just, I just, I don't know. Don't get discouraged. Yeah, you should, I'll be sure how you cut the cabbage. I can't handle cabbage. Oh, okay. Yes, we show how to cut it. Yes. All of it. That was Patty. Yep. Everything yes, is Patty, Patty. I do. Patty, but I will really, I know these knives I use are expensive. They are expensive. I'm going to tell you that now. They are very, very expensive. But these are a lifetime right here. Let's look at Switch up the look of it. I know. What? These right here are a lifetime right here. Patty, you will never have to worry about nothing. So I, I have a pair of scissors, but me and my mom split a set because they are expensive. I used to actually work for this company. And so um, the scissors, how we used to do the demonstration, we would cut through pennies with them like butter. And I'm talking about we wouldn't have to squeeze. It would be like clip, pennies. It would cut through them like that. That's how we, that's how we would demo them. That's how sharp they are. I wonder if I have another bell pepper that's on, on this counter. I might have one on this counter. Yep, so that's how we would do them. We would demo them like that. And we would, uh, that's how we would show them off. And we would get a lot of sales that way because people were like, wow. And the thing about them is that no matter how long you have them, you always can send them in to sharp. Getting sharpened, these are. These are 20, 19 years old, 19 years old. These are mm. they're 19 years old and they still cut like yesterday. Ain't no, I cut through everything with these, like, um, uh, everything seriously. Like, she'll tell you mm -hmm. they cut through everything, like, but they they call us all the time and be like. Do you want to see your knives in? Get them sharp when you can, or whatever. But they they make good. Look up, cut cut. They expensive, mm -hmm. but I recommend you to get like one or two knives just to have for like those tough things that you can't do. Those big heavy cabbage mm -hmm. or some of those big thick sweet potatoes that's really really hard to get through. Like you would get some of those that's like really really tough to get through. You can get those. Yeah, they, 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 I think they are too, says Dorbe. That's what exactly what they are. And look at Mister Ransom. Oh, oh. Yeah, they cut through a penny, huh? Okay, yeah. So what do you see, man? What's the next thing? I don't know. I was saying if I had another bell pepper. If not, okay. then I just use what I got. Let me just in the refrigerator. I see triple C back there in the refrigerator. Oh, sorry, guys. Let me see the refrigerator. I don't know. May not have none. They might have threw the one away that was on the counter up here. It was one right here by the coffee pot, but they might have threw it away. Cause I didn't see it today. Tangbe might have threw it away when she was cleaning up. 
They don't know these kids. These, you want to you wanna play, Lord? You want to play, Lord? You want to play, Lord? Oh, is it? It's in the okay. The Benny Ben. That works because I want that. Yeah, I'm really, really big on vegetable, on bell pepper and onion in my spaghetti. Like I'm really big on it. That's I really like one. it a lot. I like uh, the vegetables to give it like a really, really good flavor. So I really try. I really like you. It's it's not really seeable. No way. Once it cooks down with the hamburger, anyways. Mm -hmm. You want to play, Lord? You want you want. Uh, where can you come? Pick? You gotta come to Indiana. Bro. He said, "Where should I come pick it? Where should you come pick what? Pick it? Oh, what are you saying? What could you come pick what game? Okay, is that everything you just saw that? Okay, we go to first video. I think it's one. This is crazy, y'all. Okay, this, 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 this. This is a." The, the software I usually use, guys. Bro, I think I texted you back, too. You get my text message? Crab. Oh, where should you come get it? You got to come up, come pick it up in Indiana. Where are you living at, King? Well, I don't know if you want to say that because you are young. Don't say where you live at. We can always ask your grandmother, okay? Um, same here, Joe. You trying to come get your crab boy a lot? I'm, I'm excited. My birthday's coming up on the 20th, guys. And Mr. Randall said, yes. He's trying to come get it. Come with your crab boil, Lord. I'm going to make one. Yeah. I'm make a big one. I don't even eat it, y'all. I don't eat He that. don't even eat crab boils, y'all. He be hooking it up. I'm excited, y'all. Birthday's coming. We got some new um, announcements coming on the birthday live. And uh, I'm excited. What's the birthday? What's the birthday on Friday? Birthday's on a Friday. So, um, you know, on Fridays, we like to do giveaways on our Friday. So, just be ready for that Friday because we're going to be doing that Friday. It's going to be giveaway day, guys, okay? Um, and like I said, for those who already won already, you probably, well, depending on what it is, we'll, we'll do what we do. But, you know, we'll make sure, especially if you're there. If you're there, you can't help but win, you know. But if it's a member type of ordeal, we'll try to make sure each member gets something, you know. So if you want a last membership thing, you're there. If you're a subscriber and you haven't won, you're going to win. What do you say? So you say you want a crab boy? You say I want to eat some of those, some of that goodness. I know I love it. Since door bed, this man introduced me to crab and crawfish. What's the first thing you introduced me to? I always ate shrimp, guys. I always love my shrimp. Um, but Joe doesn't eat it, so I basically for him, I was kind of like telling him, babe, I like it to be cooked this way. I like it to be, you know, I had to tell him how I wanted it to be cooked, how I wanted it to be seasoned, because he couldn't try it himself to eat it. So I'm like, babe, I want to season like this. I don't like much seasoning on my seafood. Since door bread, you like a lot of seasoning? How do you like yours? Because I know some people like them really like, they might boil it down. Mr. Randall, if you're still here, anybody who's still here, do y'all like y'all seafoods? Like real heavily seasoned? Do y'all like them a little bit? Because I see some people that cook them down in like a sea, seafood oil or seafood boils. It. It's juices and stuff in there, seasonings. But after they get done with it, they load it up with, like cover up the shell with, um, with seasonings. So when they cover the shell with multiple seasoning, is that for you like to suck off the seasoning with the, off the shell? Because yeah, I don't I eat my so. shell, so I don't really care about eating the sucking off the so. shell. I think so. You basically eating that. You know what I'm saying? You basically it's like having a sunflower flavor. seed. Yeah. It's like having a sunflower seed. You suck on the outside and then eat it off. I'm ready to crack it open, so I don't want to. I'm not gonna waste some seasoning. Mm. I'm ready to crack that baby open. I'm like, <laughs> and this the the crazy thing about this seafood boil. Okay, how long do you boil a crab leg? Look at King. How long do you boil with them clusters? I'm not sure how long you boil. You, not, you don't want, I do not want, I don't do that either. I don't either. Since door, I don't do all the Cajun stuff. Some people cook them different. Yeah, exactly, Mr. Ryan, but do you, what do you do? Do you like a lot of your seasonings on top? But it really depends on how you want to eat them. Yeah, because New Orleans known for like seasons. And yeah, but I'm just saying though, yeah. but I'm just I'm asking Mr. Random and everybody else who eats them. Do you all like to suck the seasonings off the shell and then crack them open and dig in? Because I feel like if I eat so much seasoning, I'm going to get burnt out. So yes, I was like... I know. Since Dora Beth uh, bored hers off yesterday. She bored hers off? Yeah, she took that off. She she rinsed that Cajun off of them. Yeah, that killed the flavor of the crab. Yeah, I want to oh. taste that. There you go. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, since Dora Beth. I mean, we got to meet each other sooner than later, since Dora Beth. We just have a ball. Since Dora Beth. And then, you know what? I got to do since Dora Beth a favor. Well, not a favor, but... I gotta do it, man. If I go to Sister Beth, I gotta try it. What are you gonna try? I'm gonna try the poke. Uh, if I meet Sister Beth, I gotta do her right, and I gotta try the poke and let everybody know it's not as bad as you think. Well, I'm gonna be cool. 
You can be full, babe, but I'm going to do it. We're going to do our live together, and she's going to make some poke. I'm going to make some for her. She'll make some for me. We're each going to make a dish for each other, and she's going to try it. I'm going to try it, and we're going to just enjoy each other's fun. Because I think we're going to do it. What do you think, Sis Dora, babe? Because I know we're going to meet each other one day. We're not that far. Yeah. We're not that far, so it's just only a matter of time that we don't we meet each other. That's gonna be like a nice fun so trip. Get in the car, we, that ain't nowhere. That's not gonna be that far. That's a nice trip, a nice little road trip, and we can vlog it. We can do a video. Hey, go live, hey y'all. We almost go to Sister Dora Bev's house, y'all. Yeah, I think it's gonna be amazing. Oh my goodness, I go, Mama. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Oh my goodness, how you doing, Mama? Such. How you hey, doing? Mama. We love you. We we're just talking about you, Mama. Such. How much we love you. Hey, Mama. He said we boil them in the seasoning and let them soak and longer. Okay, so you boil them and then you let them soak. See, that's what I was wondering. I thought some people be boiling for a long time, so you don't boil them that long because it's gonna be overcooked. Yeah. But what you can do is you can boil them and then let them soak. Thank you so much, Mr. Ram. Okay, so that's what you do. You boil them and then let them soak in there. See, I understand that. I understand yeah, the soaking process. That, 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 all that flavor throughout the yeah, I all that that the Cajun stuff. Yeah, there. I can. I, if that's what you want, depending on what flavor. Like you got a nice flavor. You don't do the Cajun, but you do what I like. Yeah. And if you want to do, I can understand it. But I, I'm just saying. And but how it's long? Be watery a little bit. Yeah, it could be watery. Okay. If you don't like it like that, because you got take you like them a certain texture. Yeah, I like mine. I'm, it just depends. That's what I'm saying. But that's why I was wondering. Also, Mister Random, do you ever after you take it out of that soaking process? Do you drizzle it with a, a dry powder? Because some people do like a dry seasoning powder, dried rub. Oh, there go Mama Such. Mama Such, you in here? We can talk about it with you as well. Mr. Random ain't a ain't a ma yet. Mr. Random on the mind? Yes, he is a ma. He a ma. He's not a member, baby. Oh, he's not a member. Yeah, he's a moderator. He's definitely a moderator. Um, he's just not a member. That's why he's not green. Green is a member. So. Oh, what? Oh, you can tell them. You can't see my on here. Oh. You can't see my. It just be black. Okay. Is Patty still here? No, you can't see a difference. No, you can't see a difference. Okay, so let me see. Let me go back, guys. I'm sorry. Um, let's see. Okay, let me see. I'm so sorry, y'all. I didn't miss the whole thing. Okay, we got that the sodium and salt is so bad for my joints. Yeah, and inflammation. Yeah, it swells me up. That's why I said too. I don't want to do too much salts and stuff because some. Yeah, and how long do y'all boil? I don't know how long you boil a bag. I don't even know how long. I don't know. I usually boil my crab boil 20 minutes. 20 minutes, y'all. Yeah. Joe and Dana, I would have already been on a road trip to see you all and pick up the boat. You let go. You let go to see it up here. Huh? You said, Joe and Dana, I would have, I would have already been on a road trip to see you all and pick that boat. You let go to see it up here. Up there. Yeah, I would love that. You know, that would be, that would be a ball. Okay, so me and two others aren't you? Mr. Ron said no dry rub, but he had them before. Okay, so what do you so you don't like the dry rubs? That's what you're saying, Mr. Yeah, Ren? that's what he said. Oh, you don't like them dry rubs? Yeah, because I mean, I feel like I don't need the dry rub. I mean, just crack that baby open and get some of the delicious juices in there. Because like you said, when you soak it, the shells can kind of get some juices inside of it, so you're good. It's going to get juices inside of it. Yeah, so that's understandable, but it's not a watery juice. It could be a seasoned juice or an oil, semi oilish. Yeah, it's going to be seasoned. Like you can soak it in like your, 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 you know what I'm saying? Like your, your, uh, you know, your surprise, your secret weapon that you put in, but I like to dip, my, dip mine in. So that's what I always do. Yeah. I like how you boil it and I can just coat it my, to my liking. Because I feel like if you soak it, you might not need to dip it. You might can just enjoy it like it is. So it's basically, you know what I'm saying? It kind of could defeat. The dipping purpose. You can just go ahead and do it like that. But I like to dip. I'm a dipper, y'all. This is how I dip everything. Like this. One, two, three. And then I let it drizzle. And I eat. One, two, three. Let it drizzle. Eat. Don't be talking about me, y'all. Okay, you say, yes, I'm getting coffee. You getting some coffee? I should get some coffee, too. You say, I'm not green? Yes, yeah, Sister Beth, you green. On the computer, you green, Sister Beth. If you're on your phone right now, you might not see the green. Or on, on uh, what is this called? On StreamYard, you see green. He said, I am just get up. I but I would be I would just green if I'm if I'm not blue. Yeah, you green and blue. <laughs> you got a green and blue color to you. Mama such got green and blue. King LX, you ain't blue yet, but he got his green. He's gonna be green and blue later because I got to put him make him a moderator. He's a member. Okay, the Pope grows until it grows the seed, if not picked. Oh, okay, okay. What all can I can you do as a mod for as a moderator? Uh, you basically do what we tell you to do so far. It's not like that. I'm just kidding. King. No, basically what you would do is if we run into the person's link, you can drop their link. Um, if yeah, there's any, yeah. any bad people, yeah, we'll let you know who to drop and stuff like that. And if there's bad people in the chat, the same mean things, you want to erase them and block them out of there. 
And like I said, if there's new people in the building and we say drop your CC, like all oh, those new people in here, drop a CC next to your name. When you we say that to you and they see the CCs, drop their link. But don't just drop, drop, drop. Take a little break, let some words come between, and then drop. You don't want to be, you don't want to see a chat where it's link, 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 link. You want to let people chat chat between themselves and then drop a link. Feel free, okay? Let it be flowing. So, Mama Such, we we're talking about this crab boil and things like that. I hope you're still here. I'm not sure if you're still here, Mama, but if you are here, Mama Such, I don't know if you make your crab where you put seasoning on top of the dry rub, but if so, do you use that dry rub as a like a sucker off like a, and then you eat it? Which I'm pretty sure it's probably what it is, but I know you said it, but I was just trying to say for those who eat it. You know what I'm saying, man? Mm -hmm. like, hey, I didn't say this. Well, I was just wondering because I just want to hear, like, you know, from those who do that. You say I do that every Thursday. Oh, you do what? You what do you do every Thursday? Oh, Mama's still here. I'm so sweet. Yeah, exactly. Like sis doorbell said, take out the trash. Sis doorbell better take out the trash. Mama said, you see that person? Mama said, did you see that person? I don't know, Mister Ram. Did y'all see that person that came in and asked me? Do I ever do any paper? What's it called, man? Any what crabs or trash bags or something? Have you ever did any trash bag crabs? Okay, so so mommy, you do both. So if it's on a, the dry rub, is me basically suck off the uh, the seasonings and you can just enjoy the inside. That's cool, man. I never tried like that before. I never, I, I'm just really basically Joe boils it a certain way and then I just begin a dip. I'm a dipper. Yeah, garbage bag crafts. I'm, yeah. So do y'all like to dip y'all stuff? Since door Beth, I didn't even get to see this. Did you um, dip your, your tails? The your crawfish tails? I didn't get to enjoy that like I wanted to. Lord, Lord, Lord. I'm about to get this video done. Oh my goodness, y'all. This is a new way. This phone editor is so different now, y'all. It updated. I will usually use um, Fillmore Go on Joe's phone, and now I can't even find it anymore. So I don't know if they're undelete. I think they're deleting this app. Hey, hug, hug. Yes, we just got. Yeah, we still on, but we started a new one though. You fell asleep, hug, hug. Oh, we love you. You said I didn't know. I didn't hear that. Wow. What did you hear? Oh, you didn't hear. Him. Yeah, they gonna say. Have you ever made trash bag crafts, or would you wear trash bag? Their name was trash trash bag fashion. You seen that bag? Yeah. That was hilarious, y'all. Okay. You said once I cook them in a boil, I hit it with more seasoning. Oh, when serving. Okay, I see what you're saying. Okay, hit it then. Mama said she hit it, man. She hit it with more seasoning. Okay, the ones I had with dry rub wasn't seasoned good inside. Oh, plain. Oh, like it didn't sit in soak, just boil. Okay, so that's what it do. So it's either or. Okay. So it could be either or. It could be seasoning outside or soaking in the seasoning. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or you can put the seasoning in the garlic butter. No, don't talk about the garlic butter. Lord, oh, Lord, Lord. No, not them. Only crab legs. Oh, okay, so you don't even. So, since Lord, if you just eat your crab boil, I mean your crawl, your mud bugs with no season, you gotta eat them. You just eat them like that. So, did you do the little head sucking like this? Yes, yeah, did. Oh my goodness, yeah, I was, I be so scared to do this. Mama Sudge, everybody who eats seafood, y'all suck y'all, y'all crawfish heads. And how do y'all feel about the crawfish sucking? Sometimes I feel like I'm gonna suck up something, like a little brain juices. How do you feel about that, man? I don't eat crawl. I don't eat seafood. <laughs> I never understand how you feel about doing that. <laughs> oh, man. Are some onions back in the ice burn, man? Mm -mm. So how many onions and stuff you got over here, man? How many of each? <laughs> Three. Three onions? Oh, yeah. Let me see. I got to edit this video. You see the difference in what it's like, huh? It changed. Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. He said, then they deleted their message. No, we deleted their message afterwards, King. That's what we do as a moderator. What you do is you delete them. And once you delete them out, their message will go away as well. So somebody, what somebody did was they hit them first. And when they hit them, they message deleted. And so they went back after they met, after that, then they went on and, uh, Patty says she is not sucking no fish heads. They went on and they deleted them out. You fool, Patty? You fool, Lord? Oh that is a fool with it, Patty. 
I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. But I'm scared. I'm gonna suck up something. I'm gonna suck the wrong thing up, Lord. I'm like some guts or something right in my mouth. I was, I was charging your juices a little bit, but I don't want to be nothing crazy. Look at King. King, okay, he fool. <laughs> Everybody said they fool. Huh? Okay, he said it was not the first time the person has hated. Oh my! Oh, this is the same person. Okay. I was wondering who, because I remember the first time you was doing some milk man. You was like, I don't care. I'm still gonna do it. Yeah. Please still eat. I love that. I love when you eat. You make it's you make it fun. I like to watch that because I like I love since door best. Um, I love since door best vlog. But man, remember we saw one today because mm -hmm. she take us on a field trip. We can sit there and chill with her while she prays and while she get her mask making on. You know, like tomorrow since door best. You wanted to get make your mask up. Whatever you want to do since door best, just have a ball and make it up, and we can just enjoy you. I like when you take us outside. You walk lucky. You come back in the house. I love that. Uh, that makes me wonder. That's what a vlogger it is. I love. I love to see vlogs too. Driving down the street, walking down the street. You know, don't you? Hey, I like that. Oh yeah. Oh, wait, you got some more stuff. Let me go back up here. You got more. What was that? Okay, you want a sticker? Oh, you want a sticker? Oh yeah, you got to start making your stickers up too. You already know how to make them though, Mister Round. You just got to make your stickers and make them one by one, one dot dot one. You know, that's the ratio. So you can start making your stickers. Cause you already got the, you know, you already know what to do. The same thing you was doing your, um, the same thing you do your thumbnails with, Mister Random. Make you up some stickers, and make them one by one ratio. Okay, there you get some more. Who that? Somebody said something to you before, man. Okay, who's this? Oh, that was Rain. Hey, Rain. Oh, okay, here we go. Hook Hook says she sees Frosted Flakes. You see some Frosted Flakes back there? You see some Frosted Flakes back there on the counter? Uh -huh. They're great. Thanks. <laughs> That's a it's a it's a it has a bit of flavoring left in it. Oh, okay. I took it down because it, you took it down. That's your watch hours. Come on, sis door bev. That's your watch hours. No, oh, sis door bev. No, it's your watch hours. Oh, sis door bev. Don't please don't do this. Don't work with nobody. Just block this person, please, sis door bev. You are amazing. We love you. Don't do that. And there goes, guess what? We got a smile in the house. Look, who was that, man? Hey, Travel, what's going on? Hey, Travel. Right, guys, I'm so used to doing all this. Guys, I got to be quiet a little bit. I'm at Hubby. This is Hubby's lane, guys. I'm sorry, y'all. It's like cooking with Joe and Dana, not Dana and Joe. Forgive me, guys. It's not a triple C and Joe show right now, guys. It's the cooking with Joe. What? I thought this was a cool person. It was just on live the other day. I'm sorry, babe, but remember I was in the hospital and I was talking to his door, Beth? This person was not alive. I thought it was cool. I thought it was a cool person. Oh, wow, yeah. Wow, I'm sorry, Sister Dorbev. You said bad outbreak of wrong enrichment. Oh, really? Hmm. Sorry, Sister Dorbev. Okay, what family? Y'all working a real late shift. Yeah, we um we just up late. Joe's cooking. We just got done finishing up our regular shift. And so Joe's doing some cooking. I don't like how his thing shake like that. So Sorry, guys. We should. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm cutting y'all. So Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm just over here editing the video. I'm done talking, guys. You can talk. If, I don't anybody say anything, so I say, no, baby, I'm just saying. You can talk, but the conversation's going on. Keep talking. Okay. Just keep going, baby. What you doing? Keep going. I ain't doing it. I just started a while ago. I just cutting on you, baby. Yeah, go ahead, baby. I'm at, why, go ahead, baby. Just... Talk. I don't care. Talk. Come on, baby. But baby, you got the conversation going on. You can't stop it now. There's no way. It's... Wait, talk. I'm going to get this video done. That's fine. Go ahead and talk, man. I'm okay. Okay, okay, baby. Everybody's still coming in. More people coming. Yeah, everybody's trying to see what's going on. More things and more. Mm -hmm. What is that? Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, Zach. How you doing? Hey, you feeling any better, Zach? Mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking, Sister Dorbet, but I was saying. I know you had gave him a wrench, so I thought they was cool people, you know? I sure wanted to say that. Um, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit later on, Sister Dorbev, because um, I'm been talking to God, and God has been revealing to me and Joe uh, certain people that, you know, that are that do that. Certain people that's in the mucks to all of us, and they're doing that. So we'll talk, we'll talk more about it. Okay, it's a real something as well, too, babe. I'm sorry. Arthur, I'm cooking some spaghetti, man. I woke up. I mean, I thought I had spaghetti sauce, but I don't have spaghetti sauce. So I'm going to have to make it, y'all. So I got some tomatoes, some tomato paste over here, and I got some 
uh, diced tomato that I'm going to make into spaghetti sauce. Mm -hmm. I already started my water boiling early. I always do that anyways. Mm -hmm. I probably got to put more in there by now because it ain't going to be enough in there to boil the spaghetti noodles. But yes. Churches are closed again down there. They're not closed here yet. I'm so sorry to hear that, says Dora Bev. Wow. We're going to definitely pray so that way they don't have no, no symptoms or, you know, they're going to be they're gonna be good. We're going to pray. We'll definitely pray. So sorry to hear that news. So I said, I am sad. My pastor and his wife was a positive for a while. I'm sorry to hear that. And King said he's just not a gaming channel. He does. He's going to do everything. What? Okay, King. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, King. And um, since you're a member, King, we're going to surprise you with something, okay? We ain't going to tell you yet, but we're going to surprise you with something, King. Just keep doing what you're doing. We're going to surprise you. We got all of our members. We're going to be surprising them with different things. You know, we got some of our members who want some goodies on our giveaway. And uh, we got some stuff we're going to do. I don't know why it's the same song. It's right, just taking a little time. I am not leaving my house, but to walk lucky and check me out. Oh, wow. Yes. This is real, but it's probably good to be stay safe as possible right now. I haven't, uh, we, our churches are still open here in South Bend. Uh, ain't nothing closed back up, but I don't watch the news, so. I don't ever know what he said. Wow, I cooked spaghetti and meatballs last night. Show my meatballs on Beauty and Beast Live feed. Great minds thinking like you're right, bro. Great minds do thinking like I haven't made those those meat homemade meatballs in a long time. Get lazy and just want to throw it all in the, in the <laughs> pot and be done. Um, yeah, no problem, Zach. That's what we're here for. We love you, Zach. We love you very much. You know we do. We're always here for you. Did we get the bad weather on Monday? Did we get bad weather on Monday? I can't remember. I think it did. It you came. got seven tornadoes? Oh. Where is that? That was hook up, up here. Oh, wow. I was catching something that you missed. That's all. Go ahead. No, I, I couldn't see you. That's what I said. Help me. Oh, let me see if we're in top. Hold on, guys. Sometimes we're being top. Where's my? I guess not. Okay. Is it, I think we can be on top on here, can we? I thought we could. I think you see everything on here, no matter what. Okay, that's good. Oh, let me see everybody. Oh, that's old. Okay. 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 So let me go. Yeah. Okay, so I think that's it, man. Yeah, I'm sure love to Zach. Told me it's all good. Mama's, yeah, everybody's good. Okay. Yeah. Man. So what are everybody doing today? Joe, what's going on in the sauce? Tomatoes. Is that it? He said, what's going in the sauce? Tomato paste. Uh, what's going on? What's going on? Yeah, probably so. And I'm going to add some sugar because um, tomato paste is really bitter. So you got to make sure you add some sugar to it. But right now, I'm going to season this meat on this and show you what I'm going to do to it. I'm going to bring it over to the table so you can see. But right now, I'm just opening up these cans of tomato paste. Opening up these cans so y'all can see how this is going to work here. First, I'm going to go over to this and rinse my vegetables off, y'all. I'm a really believer in, like, rinsing my vegetables. I just don't do that. I don't know why this is acting up all of a sudden. Yeah, I found a really good can up on sale a while ago. While ago, and it's really good. Yeah. So. What he says, sweet basil. What is sweet basil? I never heard of sweet basil before. I heard of basil. Like I'm not. I don't. I don't like to use basil, but Dana do. Not too bad. I love my basil, John. Yeah, Dana's, I don't. I mean, I use. I use uh, Italian seasoning that's got basil in it, but I don't use uh, just straight basil. I don't know. It just don't work good for me. Spaghetti was the first dish I ever made in my life, guys, so 
I usually can make it with anything that's red. I tell you, I always make that joke all the time. If I got noodles and hamburger, I can make spaghetti out of something. Some form of it. I know, I know basil is a herb, but I ain't never heard of sweet basil before. I never heard of that being sweet before. That's what I'm saying. I definitely know what herbs is. Thyme, rosemary. Uh, what else is it? Wait, oregano, oregano mint. mint, all that. I know, I know what that is, but I'm just saying I ain't never heard of it being sweet before. Yeah. It's got different, they got different things like smoked paprika. Yeah, no. I never heard that either. Okay, you already adding sugar. Yes, you got, because that sugar, if you don't know, uh, tomato paste is very, very mm -hmm. bitter. You do. If you don't know how to work with it, it's very bitter. Yeah. You can add a little butter and a little bit of sugar and it'll break the bitterness out of the tomato paste. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, yep. And you can put you in there. What else you put in there? Can you say what you what all you put in there, baby? I'm about to bring it over to the table. Oh, uh -huh, so okay. So Joe, about to show us all in there, guys. Because I seen Patty said I don't know if you've seen that out. Yes, yeah, it was Okay, he so said take hamburger meat and roll roll it up into a meatball. Oh yeah, yep. He's not gonna do that, but yeah, but that's how I do it. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's how you do it. That's I don't how you use do it. No store bought meatballs. Oh yeah. Never. Yep. When I make meat spaghetti and meatballs, that's the only way to do it. Oh, Patty said she never made spaghetti sauce in years. I use it from a jar, do you? Yeah. And I don't, uh, those store bought meatballs and spaghetti don't taste good. Yeah. I like to make those. I like to use those store bought meatballs on, uh, meatball subs, though, yeah. like Italian kind. Yeah, oh, no, no, no. I like them on there, too. I wish I could show this picture without it being so blurry. I want to show the kid, show them this picture with the kid. Who made this, baby? The kids made this, right? What was this for, back? For Father's Day? Yeah. I wish I could find. I wish I could show this without it being blurry. It's probably gonna, you know, it ain't gonna work out. It's gonna be blurry. But this is where our kids made us for made Joe for Father's Day. So I, I don't know why I want to show it for us. It's waffles, waffles rice. Uh, what is it called? Jelly muffins, potatoes and onions, biscuits and gravy, eggs and that's it. Bacon urn. That's where our kids made us for breakfast. Oh, wow. I can't do it. But anyways, yeah, that's what kids made for breakfast for Father's Day. They always cook us a breakfast, um, Mother's Day, Father's Day, and our birthdays. That's the good thing about when your kids grow up, y'all. Okay, get you some rest, Zach. We love you so much. Okay, get you some good sleep. You can see it. Thank you, Sis Doorbell, for the love. Okay, and um, you said take ramen. Don't put the salt packet, but put spaghetti sauce on. Oh. Now, look at King. King, now, I don't know, King. It might be all right. I don't know. You fool, man? I'm King, I, I might be full, but you know what? You know, you know, y'all as youth, y'all be trying different things. Our son be trying stuff with that ramen until he tried different things. Oh, thank you so much, Patty. Yeah, they cook really, really good, y'all. They cook really, really well, and uh, I just thank God for them. And a lot of stuff, though, like everything that we cook, I wrote a recipe book for them. I got a whole cookbook with handwritten recipes because me and Joe, like sometimes, like it's late like this, we'll take our time and we'll write down every teaspoon it takes to put in to season it the right way. So that way when they get older, they can cook. Now they've already been cooking now. We got an almost 18 year old, almost 15, but they cook already. But when they get older, if they want to prepare, oh my goodness, y'all, this is how many kids we got. We have two boys and a girl. Our oldest child is 17. She's a girl and she'll be 18 in October. Um, our son, our oldest son is 14. He'll be 15 in December. Our baby son is seven. Uh, he just turned seven in July. And you said when you don't have ingredients, hey, you got look at King, King, King gonna say when you don't have ingredients, just go ahead and do what you gotta do. King gonna say use the noodle, the ramen noodles to make it get. <laughs> All right, King. If we got film, hey, it's called uh, what is it called, man? Making do. <laughs> Making do. Making do, King. That's what I'm talking about. That's amazing, but yeah. So they not a cook. I remember we had that uh, you know, the crown book. That was going around where everybody gets sick and everything. We had that guy. We got we got caught with it. And uh, our babies made us Easter dinner. They made chicken and dressing and yams. They made it all by themselves, y'all. We was over here sick. I'm sorry. We was over here sick, y'all. 
It made ham and chicken and dressing. What else they made, man? I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. I wish I break down. I'm sorry, man. It just that's touching, you know. They knew we couldn't do it. It was like we're gonna make this food, y'all. They hooked it up, y'all. <clears throat> but that was amazing. They, they hooked it up, didn't they, man? Yeah, they did. You need me to get something? No, I was just saying with anything in there for my stomach. <laughs> but they hooked it up, y'all. Oh, you said send your copy of the cookbook, please. Look at you. <laughs> All right, so yeah, I got my hamburger here. I got about maybe like two and a three, four pound, I think, of hamburger meat in here. And so what I'm gonna do is, I did I eyeball every season I use, but I'm probably gonna put like maybe a, I want to say like maybe a teaspoon of regular salt in here, because I like to have a regular salt for a little bit of flavor. But I use seasoned salt mostly because seasoned salt has like a lot of different herbs and spices. If people don't know that seasoned salt has a bunch of stuff in it. So I'll probably use like a teaspoon of salt on here. All right. I'll just go with that. And so then I'm going to follow that up. And I got some Italian seasoning right here. This is Sam's Choice Italian seasoning right here. As you can see. Okay. So then I'm going to go through here. And this one, these turn jars, I really don't care for it, but this is a really good Italian seasoning. So I'm gonna use this turn jar. And I'll just go through here. Get a nice amount, because this is, I'm not using no, uh, this spaghetti sauce, I'm, I mean this spaghetti sauce. This uh, tomato paste I'm using, ain't got no Italian or nothing in it. So you basically gotta basically build your own everything out of, so I'm doing that right now. Don't it seems like I'm putting a lot, but don't very much come out of here when I twist this thing for some reason. So I'll do like that. We're gonna twist this, twist it, we're gonna twist it. We're gonna get this pack of ground beef coated pretty good. All right. So then we're gonna go behind that. We're gonna have onion powder. I like to use onion powder. Are you feeling well today, Dora? So I'm gonna go behind that and I'm gonna go behind that with a little bit of onion powder. Even though I'm using onion, I cut onion. I like to use onion powder because it has a different flavor to it to me for some reason. Ain't very much in here, so I think that's the rest. Yeah, pretty much the rest. I got another one in there, but I don't need that much. And so then after that, I'm gonna go behind it with mist onion, minced garlic. I said mist onion, minced garlic. I'm gonna go behind it. I'm gonna hit it with garlic, with some garlic. Okay, so we got that. So then I'm gonna go behind that and I'm gonna hit it with some seasoned salt. I was just saying if anybody answered, said anything. So I'm gonna go behind and I'm gonna hit it with some seasoned salt. Okay. Sounds good. Hook up. Okay, I got that. And so here, I got my vegetables right here, guys. They just clean and wash vegetables. So I'm gonna take these vegetables. And I am going to add this in. I'm gonna add my vegetables in. You might know where you can get in the video, man. No, I'm doing that. I'm doing that so you can see if you can read the things while I'm putting this in here. I can't see you read it. Same time. Okay, so I'm putting this in as you can see. Right here, and I'm gonna go behind and I'm gonna mix this in. I'm gonna mix this in. And I'm gonna add a little bit more season salt after I mix this in. Mix this in. Who made what? Tell me. Well, I'm looking at the Tony Tiger back there, not the spaghetti. <laughs> Everybody looking at the Tony Tigers back there. You see plenty of onions, Joe. You said plenty of onions? Plenty of onions. It's plenty. P L E N Y. Plenty of onions. <laughs> Okay, to mix that with 
like meat lovers, yo. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm just mixing it in because I like to get my onions and bell peppers all the way through my hamburger when I'm making spaghetti. I do. That's one thing. Is that really different now, baby? Is that really different program really different now? I'm not sure yet. I'm, I'm just I'm still blowing the video. So yeah, I'm gonna go back through here. I see some spots I missed. I'm gonna add some more Italian seasoning. It's all the Italian to up here. Real good, real good, y'all. Okay. Like that. Then I'm going to go through, and I'm going to hit it with some more seasoned salt here. Because honestly, y'all, for some reason, the Spice Supreme seasoned salt, it's basically just all herbs, and it's not very much salt in it at all. I don't know if y'all sell this in y'all city, but it's like a lot of herb. It's basically herb-based. When you brew it down, huh? Yep. And there's not a lot of salt in this at all. So it's just basically herb-based seasoned salt. Then I'm going to go through here, and I'm going to add my parsley. Y'all like parsley a lot. Do anybody else use parsley? Because I like it. I like it. I like that fresh flavor it gives it. It gives off a fresh flavor. I see y'all, my meat is pretty much all seasoned up here, as y'all can see. All seasoned. Y'all probably can see it from there, but it's all seasoned up. And so I'm going to go to the stove here, guys. I'm going to put this on about, mm, I'm going to put this on probably about, about, about six or seven. So I can cook up, and I, I let it cook a while, so those, uh, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end up, I'm probably going to move this over here by the stove so you can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to take you on a small field trip right quick, so I'm going to hit the, I'm going to knock the camera off, and then I'm going to move it over here by the stove so y'all can see what I'm doing right quick. Is that okay with y'all? All right. Be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. I'm at the stove now. Huh? No, that's good. That's good. That's perfect. That's perfect. All right, guys, I'm at the stove now. As y'all can see, my son cooked earlier. He made some. What does he make, baby? Chicken fried rice. Yeah, he made some chicken fried rice earlier. So I'm at the stove now. And I got my hamburger on. I got some water boiling over here for my noodles I had going already ready. Getting this mixed in here good. It's a lot of hamburger, y'all, so I don't know if it's going to be enough seasoning. I like for my food to be really, really seasoned. Well, I don't like, I don't like salty food. There's a difference in salt, salty food 
and well-seasoned food, there's a big difference. I tell people that all the time. There's like a major difference in salty food and well-seasoned food. He said, we are in our cooking now, kids. Yes, we are. She said, Dana, where did you get the toilet paper roll pattern? I haven't seen it. Patty said, that's a bunch of seasoning. No, Patty, that's not a bunch of seasoning. If you like well-seasoned food, that's trust me. I've been cooking a long time, Patty. I, I know I, I can do to this, Patty. Huh? Yeah, because when you pour the grease off, you lose you lose a lot of season on top of that. So what kind of spaghetti y'all like to use? Do y'all like to use um let's see, do y'all like to use um thin spaghetti? Y'all like to use thick. I like to use I like to use whatever's on sale. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, I, this is thick spaghetti. But I normally like to use thin spaghetti. I like for it to uh, some about thick thin spaghetti to me it adheres. It just to me is just better. I don't know. I like it better. But this is thick spaghetti. Uh, I'm gonna let it cook. I like my. Oh, I don't like al dente spaghetti. I don't like al dente spaghetti. I don't know about y'all, but I don't really care for al dente spaghetti too much. I like mine to be tender. How about y'all? Do y'all like al dente spaghetti? Or do y'all like it tender? I love the thin spaghetti best. And yeah, me too, says Dora Beth. I like the thin spaghetti best too. Skinny noodles and not and not stiff noodles. I not stiff noodles. Yeah, I I don't like the al dente noodles. Like I don't like them. Al dente noodles, like I, I don't know. When they get done, I'll be like, that need to be cooked some more. Like, where's the rest of the cook? Like, cook them some more. Like, that ain't done. Lord, I need some more cooking to that. That's what I'll be telling myself. Like, so I'll make sure my noodles is done. And this is almost a pound of spaghetti, not quite a pound of spaghetti. Because I don't want to cook a pound of spaghetti. Who would ask about the pattern? Oh, that was Patty who asked about the pattern, girl. Uh-uh. Who put that pattern? It's on Ravelry, Patty. I think it's like the only one that's on Ravelry. The toilet paper doll. Toilet paper doll. <laughs> Cover. It's the only one. I want to get me some. I want to buy me a couple books. I couldn't find any ebooks on them, though, y'all. Only books I found were store bought books. I mean, were like eBay or something like that. And it was like none at all you can yeah, buy. Yeah. Like an so that I can order that's some really fancier ones. So I'm going to try to see. I might, I'm going to keep looking. I'm going to do this one as well. This is a little more of a basic pattern, but I'm going to keep looking and see. I, I can still make this pattern my own, too, though. I didn't think about that. What kind? Y'all you, hear that triple C going? Maybe we could talk her into making her own pattern after she get it down back. That'd be good. So there ain't that many out there. Wow. Maybe if you get it down pat, you can make your own. Wow. After you get it down good, wow. that might become a popular thing that people want to get into with that, that roll, that, that toilet. It's really nice. I've never seen that like that before. So what kind of seasons do y'all use in y'all spaghetti? What kind of stuff do y'all put in y'all? Say good morning, everyone. Hey, hey, sis Gwen, how you doing? Good morning. Hey, sis Gwen, good morning. Good morning to you. You said maybe, but Dana is busy. She doesn't have time to spit. Let me see. Let me see. Praise the Lord, everybody. Do y'all sleep? Yes, we do sleep, says Gwen. Says, Joe, do you eat your spaghetti cold like leftovers? No, I don't eat my spaghetti cold. Like, I'll heat it up afterwards, and I'll eat it afterwards. 
Yeah, my stomach is real bad, so I can't really eat no leftovers like that. Like I can't do it. I can't eat a cold. I said leftovers. <laughs> Dang. And my wife gets on me when she sees me eating any cold food. She gets on me bad. Yes, please. Oh, man. Yeah, I can't really see nothing. You was fine. I said, I said well, everything was good, baby. Yeah, it's okay to chat. Everybody wants to hear from both of us. Everybody just want to hear from both of us. That's all right. King XL said he likes to use garlic salt. Is it? It's six. It's getting to be six in the morning. Really? Yep. Y'all, do y'all notice when y'all put a lot of vegetables inside y'all hammer? It makes a bunch. It like makes a lot. Yeah, you set the doll. Yeah, you set the doll in the toilet paper roll. I'm trying to see exactly. Is it a full doll or do you break the legs off? I don't know. I only do stick the legs down inside the hole. I haven't got that part yet, so let me show see. But I definitely know that you. Um, I definitely know that you can. Uh, what's it called, man? You you stick you put the doll over that, and so that big dress it kind of gives you like one of those uh kind of bigger. Big fluffy dress. Yeah. Fluffy dresses, and it makes it look like that. It comes with the toilet paper, which is really is cute. It matches. It can match your bathroom. You know, whatever color your bathroom is, it'll make it look cute. Yeah, the morning says, we love you so much. Mama said, you still here or are you gone? So when, I, before you came in, we was, we was saying something about you earlier. When did you, uh, when you want to do those videos? Triple C was saying, that's what we, I, and when Triple C said, I was just saying something about you. I forgot was, what we was talking about. Yeah, Mama Such? Yeah, I forgot what we were saying about Mama Such. When I seen her, yeah. it just made me forget what, what I was saying. So, what does it say? Spaghetti sounds good. Do it, sis Gwen. That's what sis Gwen says. Spaghetti sounds yeah, good, baby. It's going to be good. It smells, it sure smells good. Love, love, love. You got some garlic butter with that. I got some fresh bread. You can actually make a little garlic butter, huh? I could. <laughs> you get the butter, you get the butter, you can grab the butter out there. I can look up a little garlic butter. I think true. You want to do it on camera? You can go on camera, too. It don't matter. He said, I appreciate that, sis. Then for the warm welcome. Love y'all too. We love you too. You know we love you. Yeah, that's how this works. So we much. love you very you much. Know, guys, if y'all don't know who Sis Gwen is, I'm sorry. Let me give you an introduction. Because many of y'all might not know Sis Gwen. She's a hardworking woman, a woman of God. She always delivers a word every morning. And I believe sometimes she does it at night. So if you can please subscribe to her, guys. And um as you see, she's a moderator here as well. But if she want, if you want to drop your own link, or somebody else can drop her link, guys, uh, you can go to her channel, ring that bell. You can get the word. We love to wake up and get some of that good word. Um, and it, it starts our day off right. If we can't actually participate and you know comment, we like to we like to put her on play and let her. If we when we sleep on her, get her in our spirit. It makes it amazing because she has a great word and she always loves to encourage others. So please go to her channel. It's God's chosen vessel, Gwen, y'all. She is super amazing, y'all, and uh, I just want y'all to all be, I want you all to enjoy her like we do. We enjoy her so much, you know, and she always makes people feel welcome. She loves everybody, and she always wants people to, you know, feel the goodness of God. So I would love for you guys to go over there and show some love, y'all. Um, and Cheryl says, good morning. Hey, Cheryl. How you hey, doing? Cheryl. Good morning. Good morning. Joe's over here making some spaghetti, Cheryl. I'm over here editing the cabbage video. Everybody say, keep on getting them videos done. And like you said, okay, I can't do it, y'all, because it'd be late. So I'm over here editing this cabbage video right now. Yeah. So you guys can't, can't say nothing about me. <laughs> I can't talk about me, y'all. Mr. Ron said, Joe got smoke, Lord. Yes, Mama Such. What I was saying was, though, sis, when are we going to start our cooking segments? When do you want to do this? And like I was talking to Sis Dora Beth, we can make it like a whatever – Every two week thing, a weekly thing, whatever you want to do, uh, and we can rotate channels. 
and we can go back and forth. Since Dora Bell said she'd be a part of it. If you don't want to go live every week or however you want to do it or do it every, I don't know, however I want to do it. Y'all know I'll do it every week. It don't bother me now. I'll do it weekly, and we can pick a day. This, or this is really easy footage, guys. Y'all don't got to worry about editing. Pick it, yeah. We don't got to worry about editing or none of that. And we can pick a day. We can start off at your house, Mama Touch, then go to Sister Dora Bev, then back here, and then back around again, and do it like that. Yeah. If you want to, you just pick a day. Let's get started. Let's do it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking because, guys, like for any, we need these hours, and the lives are real good hours. I mean. And you don't have to edit anything. You know, you think about it like that, and you got to eat. So even if you're making a small dish, even if it's just something simple, if you got the time just to film it, make you a little small spot on the countertop or whatever, and just film it real quick, it makes it as you got your watch hours because people that came in and watched your live, you didn't have to edit anything and go back and put the letters in it and put the words in it. That's kind of that's what kind of gets a discouraging. Like, oh, I got to edit another video. You go in there, you got your people coming in, you're getting your hours. And you eating at the same time you got your dinner done, so that's that's like a that's like an easy A. Yep, easy easy A. Oh, yeah, and just, desserts, yes. Look, Sister Dorbeth says, "Oh, and desserts." Oh exactly. yeah, most definitely and desserts, Sister Dorbeth. Mm. I would like to do uh, my famous peach cobbler on here. No, no, no. Uh, my sweet potato pie. I'm very I'm known in this city for the sweet potato. I'm the sweet potato pie guy in this city. So we're like. Um, Yes, so Jessica, I'm waiting. What is that? Waiting this live chat from the nether. Hi, Jessica. How you doing Hello. from the nether? Welcome in. Welcome in. If Jessica. you're not family members with us already, become family with us. We appreciate you. Yeah, we'll come and show you some we'll love. Come too. show you some love too. I'm watching this live chat from the Netherlands. How are yeah. you? I'm Dana. You can't see me right now, yep. but this is my husband Joe. Patty said super potato pie. She's in. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Everybody's everybody hitting the welcome. Sis Dora Beth is drawing up the welcome sign. She's a member. She's drawing up the welcome. So welcome in, Jessica. Um, if you are a content creator, we also help people get channels. Uh, grow channels as well. But we craft. I'm a crocheter. My husband helps with my crafting as well. He crafts himself and he also cooks. As you see today, he's over there whipping up spaghetti. Today's spaghetti is on the menu. Sister Green says, oh, really? Hmm, bro, Joe, I make a mean sweet potato pie. Talk about my grandmother. Let's bake. Okay. Come on, let's do it, Sister Green. Wow. Let's do it. Hey, and it's more, the more, the merrier. That's what I'm talking about. The more the merry, yes, that's what that's why I am. I'm known as a sweet potato pie guy here in this around here. I actually uh sell a lot of them during Christmas, I mean Thanksgiving and Christmas. I actually wasn't able to do some. Well, no, I did some this year. Yeah. I didn't do nothing for thank uh for Easter because we we got sick. Yeah. yeah, but I did a bunch of them at, at Christmas and uh at Thanksgiving. I did so many at Thanksgiving. I was burned out at Christmas time. They was calling me, and I think I only sold like five at Christmas time. But I was so burned out. I'm like, man, I don't even want to see a sweet potato pie for a long time. Don't show me no pie. I don't want to see nobody's pie because I'm burned. I was just burned out. Burned out from making them over and over and over again. Mm -hmm. The money's good. The money was decent. But a lot of people in our city sell them for ten bucks each, and I don't, I don't be trying to give people. I sell them for eight. Everybody, uh, my wife is like, "Well, you need to sell them for ten, like everybody else." Uh, we, and then we thought about it. We sit down for a minute. We was like, "Well, we've been blessed. We bless others. Let's keep on doing what we do." And that's what we did. So we be selling them for eight dollars in our city, and we usually sell we sell a bunch of them. I think at Thanksgiving, baby, will we make like forty of them. Yeah. Made like 40 pies during Thanksgiving time. So we sold, we sold a bunch. I mean, it was a bunch we sold. I'm actually y'all letting this, that make sure these vegetables are getting done. I'm about to now get ready to drain this hamburger. These noodles is almost done over here. Mm -hmm. Let me set a hamburger. Let me set a uh, collar in that. Uh, those uh, tomato plates over here. Y'all, for those who just coming in, uh, I didn't have any spaghetti sauce. So I was taught how to make spaghetti with tomato paste at a very early age 
I was taught how to make spaghetti with any type of sauce. So I can make spaghetti with anything. Tomato paste, uh, tomato sauce, spaghetti sauce, any type of spaghetti sauce that's available. I was I can make spaghetti with it. Mm -hmm. I've actually guys, I've actually made spaghetti with with uh man what you for. Really? Yeah, I didn't really care for it, but I made some good with manwich. Everybody yeah. else liked it, but I didn't care for it. Really? Yeah, that's when I was a kid. My mom was like, "Oh, just use the manwich sauce. You can use that." And I didn't like it, but I made it with that before. These noodles are almost done. Yeah, I usually let these bigger noodles cook longer than where to say cook because I like them to cook down. I don't like that. Uh, I don't like that uh you call it what I'm saying. I don't like that al dente taste to a noodle. I want mine to be cooked down and especially when I add my butter to it, I like for it to, to cream down and just have that the right the right texture, the right flavors going on. Right now I'm in this hamburger drain. I'm just letting it drain over here. Make sure it's drained up. Yeah. Make sure it's drained mm -hmm. good. All right. And you say you have done that, Joe, on also meatloaf with man, which really, huh, that sounds good. You too. said what, what I've done? Since Roy has also done meatloaf with man, which as well. Really? That might be all right. Mm -hmm. That sounds good. Because I actually like my meatloaf. Uh, I actually like my, uh, well, I make up a sauce for my meatloaf. I actually use um a few different things. I'll probably mm -hmm. do a video on it, but I do a red sauce as mm -hmm. well. Mm -hmm. And I'll probably make up like a, uh, I'll show, I'll show a video on it and show y'all exactly what I do or whatever. Mm, that'd be great. But, uh, yes, this door, but definitely. I like that little sweet contrast with the bell pepper and onion. I think that's like a very, very good flavor when people do that. That contrast between the two mm -hmm. is really, really good. So I'm letting this hamburger drain, guy. The noodles is getting done. Mm -hmm. Like, like uh, random said, I'm, 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 I'm smoky, lot. Mm -hmm. And um, who else said that? That was um, Sis Queen said she make her own sauce as well. Okay. All right, and so Jessica loves to hook. She loves to crochet and she loves to cook. And she's also a teacher at the primary school. That's awesome. That's Jessica, awesome. her favorite hook size is a size five millimeter. That's awesome. Yeah, that's one of my five, my favorite sizes as well. Five millimeter. And for some reason, I'm falling in love with the six millimeter lately, guys. I am. A lot of my patterns I've been doing, especially the cardigans I make for my family, require a um, six millimeter, guys. So I'm kind of happy right now. Hey, guys. So I got that done. That's done. I'm just waiting on these noodles to get done. They getting there. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna switch sides with this, so they can get done quicker. Cause I was actually boiling that on the smaller eye. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna add this big can of stewed tomatoes to my hamburger. I'm not stewed tomatoes, diced tomatoes. I don't know about you, but I like to make my sauce up into a meat sauce. I don't like to uh, make the sauce on the side or nothing like that. I like to make mine directly into my meat. That's the way you would know exactly what your sauce going to taste like before you add your noodles to it. A lot of people are like, oh, well, I like to make mine up on the side. No, uh, no, I like to add mine directly to it. Everybody, everybody got their ways of doing things. Babe, can you just dig me a cup of that sugar out here, please? Mm -hmm. I'm not going to use it all, but I'm just going to sprinkle it. So 
So what do y'all usually do when y'all making up y'all uh What do y'all usually do when y'all making up y'all uh sauces for y'all spaghetti? Do y'all add it to the meat or do y'all make it on the side or what do y'all do? Since Norm Bim said Joe, my favorite spaghetti sauce to use for my lasagna is sweet basil. Oh my. Oh my guys, it's sweet basil sauce. And she says how so how is the Rona issue affecting your schools over here? Just okay. She's talking Justin. She says, I know what I'm making. I know what I'm making for dinner now. Thank you for the spaghetti suggestion. Okay, says Gwen. Sounds amazing. Okay, so uh Jessica says we have our summer, our summer holiday at the moment. Oh, y'all got summer holiday still? Okay. But after the break, the schools are open again. Oh wow, y'all still got summer uh vacation. Okay. Yeah, over in like the Netherlands, something like that. They call it a vacation holiday. I like that. So, y'all, so I'm gonna sprinkle a little sugar in here. That's for the bitterness. I may need some more. Who knows? But I'll start off with a little bit to see where I'm going. I don't like sweet spaghetti. I'm sorry. I don't know if people eat their spaghetti sweet, but I don't like it sweet. I like my spaghetti savory. Mm. I don't like sweet spaghetti. I don't. It can be like a little a tad bit sweet though, or not, no, sweet, not sugary sweet. That's not yeah, not sugary sweet. I don't but like you want to like have that. like a little a sweet sweetness too. A yeah. Bit. So what I'm gonna do is I like to use my same uh, juices from my spaghetti because I'm cooking them over here. The spaghetti almost there, guys. But I'm gonna use my same juice, the water from my spaghetti, in my uh. So let's try one of these and see. You add it all together, yeah? He said, I mix sauce with meat like you're doing. Oh, okay, yeah. He said, I will. The kids teacher, we went, oh, okay, yeah. Whatever, we weren't masked, Jessica. Okay, and yeah. And you said sweet and savory, yeah, sweet and savory, yeah. Okay, so let me add a little of that water in there. I like to add a little at a time because I don't want to mess it up, y'all. So let's add a little bit at a time here. I got some more tomato paste over here just in case. So I'm probably just gonna put the rest of it in there. Okay. Oh, I add a little bit more here. Okay. Mix this in. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know about y'all, but I'm a trier of what I'm cooking. I like to make sure it's right, so I'll try it in between time if I have to. I know it's probably gonna need some more sugar. I don't know about y'all, but my Tomato paste be bitter. So let's get this spoon out of here. Let's see. Let's get in there, guys. A little bit more sugar. Do you want any garlic bread? Should I make a garlic bread or is it probably over now? It's up to you, baby. I don't mind. Okay. This is bigger than the devil. What do you think? Oh, this line is So, uh, I'm taking here. <laughs> and I just drain my, I just drain my, uh, spaghetti. Uh, I'm getting the rest of out of this pot. That is new one. Yes, water, a little bit of water for your noodles, and not it's good. Keep it going, good now. And you said uh, throw it on the wall, Joe. Sweet basil is awesome. Yeah, it is. I want to try some of that. I like the basil. I love my basil anyway. So. Yeah. So let's start this back. Throw these noodles in here. You gotta see that pot's pretty full. Cool. Okay, uh, let's do this. Okay, guys. Uh, rest of this in here.
My mom said when she do this, it's old school. She's like, this old school right here. You gotta, you gotta know what you're doing to do this. Everybody can't use the mirror place. That's what my mom always said. Yeah. Sticky said, Lord, Lord, Lord. Hey, Sticky. Yes, sir. Jessica said they don't need to make any masks. I mean, they don't need to wear them. Why is that? So yeah, I'm letting this cook up, y'all. Let me turn it down a little bit. Okay, let me get my mess, y'all. Sorry, I got a little quiet here. I was just getting everything together here. Let me try to cook up and see where I'm at. See if I need to add more seasoning to it. See if I need more sugar. Because sometimes you can put some sugar in there, y'all. I did that one day, y'all. I was, I was, uh, I had some tomato paste. And I was using tomato paste. And I, uh, what I did was I was cooking. And I didn't uh, let it cook up first. Touch the sauce until it hits the place. He said, good. I usually don't let the noodles touch the sauce until it hits the plate. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I don't make mine like that. I like mine to mix, yeah. mix together. Yeah, everybody make it differently. Yeah. We have to mix it all together. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me, i still here, yeah? Yeah, that's kind of, this way right here more is more, in more black homes, we usually mix ours together. It is. That is it. We do. It's just be honest. In black homes, we usually mix ours together. Hey, Miss Random said, "Law." God, I'm going to have to get a fork out and try this and see if I need more seasoning or anything. Okay. No, I'm trying something. Okay, yeah, let's see. So let's see if I need more seasoning or what I need. Let's see. We may need some, guys. Let's see. I think we might need. Maybe a pinch of Italian season. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think maybe a pinch of Italian season. Baby, do you have an Italian season over here? Mm -hmm. This is Woo! Thank you so much, Sis Gwen. Sis Gwen gave us a super chat. That Thanks, is so Sis sweet. Gwen. Thank you so She's much, so Sis Gwen, amazing. for the love. Thank you for the love. Thank you so much. You are so amazing, okay, Sis guys, Let's put a little Italian seasoning in here. All right. Let's try this one more time. Mm. 
Let's see. It's looking amazing, though, guys. Let me see if I can get Triple C opinion on what she thinks here in a minute on this next go around here. I know she edited in the video, so that's why I didn't bother her, but let's see if we can get her to go, mm. If I can get her to go, mm, then I know I got it, y'all. Let's see. Triple C. That spoon don't know how many blessings is about to start. Thank you so much, Jessica, for love. Since Dora Beth, she wants some of that. You definitely can have some since Dora Beth is so much. Okay, Jessica, do you have videos? Oh, yeah, Jessica, do you have any videos? Okay. Okay, guys. The ratio of everything is perfectly done. And we are done here, guys. Right, I just posted Sis Gwen's link, guys. Sis Gwen is an awesome channel, guys. Please go be a blessing to her because she's so a blessing to so many people, guys. She loves to deliver the word and she loves, she loves to encourage others. And I love that about her. And so what I may do here, I'm thinking about it right here. I might take y'all back to the table. And I might I might make some quick garlic bread. Okay. You want to go back on the field trip again? Let's go on the field trip one more time, guys. We're gonna go back Maybe to the table. Oh, you want to get out? Huh? Okay. Let's go on the field trip. Yeah. I got the. Yeah, I get the everything out of here. Okay. Stop the camera. I don't want y'all to get dizzy over here, y'all. Oh, love field trips. <laughs> yes, guys. So we're back. We're about to mix some of this garlic bread up, guys. Y'all, guys, y'all. I said, I'm almost done with this editing too. Bad. Yeah, I'm sweating, y'all. So what you want? You gonna, make, you gonna do it up? Mix it up, man? What you want? I'm gonna let you do it. Oh, okay. That's not bad. Sounds like you want to read the comments? Yes, I'll read the comments. Okay. Okay, me too. I need some pasta. Stop this Disney. You need some pasta, sister? Right you can get this. I said, I'm going to for sure need six plates of that. Sticky, you can get six plates of this. You all, that's all you need. I uh, said, oh, I do like Parmesan, but I don't think I have none, but I do have oh, some. Sounds it sounds amazing. Oh, my wow. Oh, my Sis Gwen said, how far are we from Indianapolis? Sis Gwen, we are about two hours from Indianapolis. Oh, two, and half, two, and two and a half hours from Indianapolis. <laughs> It all just depends on how fast you drive. I usually get from here to in and out of about two two hours and fifteen minutes or so. And that's just driving normal speed. It just depends on what part of Indianapolis I'm going to. Traffic. Yeah, and traffic and all that. Like downtown area, we usually get down to downtown area probably about two and a half hours, like my wife said. Sorry about that, guys. I don't know Cookie sheets. Let's see how far. 
Oh, you have a sister in Indianapolis, Sister Gwen? I didn't know that. We didn't know that. That means piece of mail is paper. Sure. That'd be perfect. That'd mean the bottom and the top would get done, all right? Yeah. Okay, sorry about that, guys. I got some. I got garlic powder in that top thing up there. Or in the top of the fridge. I, I forgot I didn't have garlic powder. I thought I had garlic powder over here. That's why I didn't. Uh, let's see. I think I have enough. Yeah, I got enough. And um, garlic powder? No garlic powder in the top right there. Garlic powder, basil, and bread, and a spoon of stir. Yeah. And a bowl to put in. Man, turn that front eye off on me, please. When you get done. As Triple C is making her own, she said, Oh, my sister there in India. Oh, okay. Yeah, Indianapolis is like around here, like that's like the closest thing. Well, that they have anything like we in South Bend, we really don't have too much of none. Back in the day when I was a kid, we used to have everything here, and now we don't really don't have too much of none here no more. So it's like really nothing really here anymore. Up, like uh, they're trying to get it back together a little bit, like really like put together some things here in the city back together, but it's not too much here get the back, get the anymore. Back the or the front? Yeah, the front one, baby. Turn the front one on. The front one's on. Well, I seen the red light on somewhere. Oh, this is the front one. Okay. Yeah. So now, yeah. yeah. Triple C the coming over to the table. I got the butter right here for you, darling. Triple C coming over. This hurts. This hurts recipe, y'all. I don't mess with this. Last time I messed. Last time I messed with this, we had soggy bread. So I don't mess with this. I let her do this. I'm gonna move over. I move over a little bit so she can get in here. I'm gonna move it over. Hey, just move the camera back a little bit so you can get in there. Hello, Brittany Duh. Hello, hello. How you doing? Welcome in. That's what we love to add to our family. I was going to go to your channel and subscribe if you had content. Yeah, that's what we like to do. Thank you so much, Sis Door Beth, for asking that. I wish you could see what I'm doing, guys. You probably can't. Maybe a little bit. I'm sure when you want to see our face. But no, no, pull it out so you can see your hands. So you can see what you're doing. You want to see what you're doing all the way? Move that, move that the way. So everybody see what you're doing. Okay. 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 I said, if you want to move it down, move it down some more. So okay. everybody can see what you're doing. Want to? Mm -hmm. Once you have to shift the computer. You have to move the screen down more. You have to pull the lap down for it. Yeah. There you go. I'm not gonna see us. Yeah, you won't see it from me, but you're gonna see what, what I'm doing. What she's doing right quick. How many pieces I make, man? I want three. Okay, so I'm just gonna make up this is nothing really crazy, guys. This is a little something what I do. So Joe wants to get three um pieces of the garlic bread. So I usually you can use any bread, guys. It, it doesn't really matter. You can use any type of bread. Check out this watch. Look at that. Get from Miss Southern Bill. Thank you, Miss Southern Bill. Um, but guys, so I'm I'm using some of this with bread. You can use your thick loaves. You can use, you know, your French breads. You can use whatever you choose. Okay, you can use whatever you like, guys. So I'm going to be using it just some regular bread. That's all. Um, this is the kind of bread we love to use as a sunbeam giant. I don't know if they sell this in y'all place where you guys live at. So with that, I also like to do. I don't know if you want to keep this. Do you want to look at this? Sure. I see we see in the comments. Sure. I don't think see. Okay, so what I usually do is I grab it. Oh, sorry. Man. You're fine, baby. You're fine. I like to grab this Imperial, which is this. Oh, you probably can't see it because everything is blurry on this TV. On this camera, I might have tried cleaning. I don't know why. It looks Let me so see. Blurry. Put it up there again. Yep, you can see it. it looks so blurry on you can words. See it. You can see it though. I know, but I'm just saying the words are blurry. No, baby, you can see the words. You can see the words. So I take a stick of that, guys. What I do with that, and I try to soften it. What I like, to, I like to use Imperial. Oh, what I like to, with Imperial is really soft. It's like, you know, it's a vegetable oil spread. If you can't use that, you can make your butter, guys. I just like to use this because it's so easy to it's so easy to smash and stir up. You know, I don't have to work to melt it in the microwave, break it down, wait two or three hours. Real butter um, definitely takes some time to soften. But like I said, guys, thank y'all for thumbing up. Thank y'all. Yeah, yes, thank y'all for thumbs up. up. We appreciate that. 
So I usually just take that and I soften it up with the spoon in my hand. I'm mean, not my hand. <laughs> in the bowl, I just soften that butter up and kind of give it a little whipping. I like to whip it up a bit. And like I said, with real butter, you can do the same exact thing. It just takes a little time. So you might have to warm it up in the microwave for a few seconds just to get it started for you. With this Imperial, you don't really have to even wait. I just grabbed this out of the refrigerator and just got the whipping. But um, let me see. Is this too much brightness on it, babe? No, you can see it well. Okay. So, yeah, I'm just going to whip this up a little bit, and I'll show you what I add to it. And like I said, it's nothing really crazy, but it's really it's really good, though. It is really good, and our kids love it. I might just make a couple extra pieces for them because they will wake up and want their own. But they might want to, I might just make extra butter for them to um, make up tomorrow. Yeah, I might make up some extra butter just for them to have some fun with. Um, I'm, gonna, I'm not sure. I think this makes up, I think this helps out. This kind of yields up about eight slices. So I'm doing eight. What? We're doing six right now. So with that, guys, I love to add about three teaspoons, three to four teaspoons of garlic powder. I don't do the garlic salt, but we do the garlic powder, guys. Because that's, that garlic pot salt is salty. Yeah, so I like to do like three. I would like to do it. I'm trying to do three. I'll do probably what I do three or four. What should you think? Sometimes I'm trying to figure out I do four because sometimes I like to half the recipes. And I don't know if I do a half a stick, I can do two teaspoons. Full stick, I can do four teaspoons. But I don't want to be too garlicky. I'll just do like a half of that then. Um, so what should I do? I did three. Did I just do three, right? Yeah. So what should I do? Should I do four and try and let's do four? Yeah, the ones. Brittany Dub, do you have a page? Yeah, do you have a channel or anything? If, if you have a channel, we could drop your link in the chat. There's only six people in the chat, but you can mm -hmm. get a few a little love if you want to. And if anybody. you want to come back, we come back at uh 11 p.m. Eastern time. Yes, at night time we come back and late yeah, in, 11 p.m. Yeah, Eastern time. Yeah, we come back late in the midnight hour. Well, God's <laughs> gonna turn it around and around. And so around. I'm mixing that in, guys, which is the four teaspoons of that of the garlic powder. And then I'm gonna whip in uh, probably about one or two teaspoons of the of the parsley, guys. I like some little color to add into my butter, so I'm probably gonna do like maybe should I do two? I'm gonna do two, guys. I'll do two since I was kind of heaping a little bit. I'll do two teaspoons. So, since Dora so I leave that stick of real butter out overnight. Yeah, and that that's how you do it. Next time. That's yeah. how you do it. But we, I wasn't sure if we was gonna make any of that. So that's why we didn't have any out. Yeah. I could have put it in the microwave a little bit too, though. Yeah. I just, since we were just, it was a spur of the moment ordeal. I didn't even, I didn't even uh, think about it. I was just like, you know what? Let me just go ahead and do this real quick. Cause we haven't really, we don't really eat this all the time. We do it when we do like our homemade lasagnas or what else do we make? Our gamasa cholis, our chicken parmesans. Who was that, CJ in the building? Hey, oh my CJ goodness. Hey, CJ Spicy, how you doing? How you been, CJ? Yeah, how you been lately? I'm, we're up making some spaghetti and some garlic bread. I'm over here whipping up a little homemade garlic butter with some parsley in it to give it a little color and a little purdiness. And Brittany Doug, yes, we do have a 530 making meet today. If you want to come on, if you want to come back at 530, mm -hmm. it will also be aged here today as well. Mm -hmm. I'm probably make up a, uh, and what's it called? I don't know if I should make one of those. Did I make one of those things up? Or like a little, little flyer? I should make one probably. Probably um, so a little uh, scheduled thing. Yeah, probably so. So this is what it's going to be looking like. I know you can't see it. That's horrible. Let me see. Put it up there. Maybe I can put this. Because it's different on the camera than it is here. Okay, let me see if I can turn it. This is, I don't know why. It's just a lot different. Yes, you can see it. You can, can see, see it like a, You can see the green and mm -hmm. stuff? Watch. Oh, you kind of see it a little bit. It was that, hey, that made it worse. The other picture was better. No, look. You can see it. Look. Oh, okay, there you guys go. So that's yeah. the green, and um, that's the, the green, and there's the, there's the parsley. So I'm going to make sure I whip it in all in, guys, because I got some garlic in the bottom of my bowl. So what I want to do is I want to make sure I whip it all up really, really nicely. Okay? Thanks, Sister Dora Bell, for dropping her link. We pretty good. Thank you. CJ said, doing good, working a lot, missing everyone. Oh, CJ, we miss you, yeah, too. we miss you, CJ, man. You got to get that work done now. You got to work. You got to get that work. I know it's, like, different going back to work now. Yeah. Everybody's going back to work. Yeah, everybody's going to work. But you gotta, you gotta get money, though. Okay, so we got this, guys. We're doing good, okay. And so now we're just gonna go ahead and spread it. It's really easy to spread. Let me see. Okay. That was a little bit of garlic on there, babe. I don't want to mix my garlic in. So it's really, like I said, it's pliable. It's good. Whatever butter you use, once it's in this whip state. 
it's very easy to spread. So you want to get you a nice little spoonful. And then all you're going to do is just spread it on your bread, just like so. Really easy, guys. So you just want to spread it on your bread. Get it on there where it's spreadable. And you want to just spread it across, like so. And it's still a little bit cold. So it's going to... Don't give me the blues, butter. <laughs> so I'm just spreading, like I, you see me, guys. I'm spreading it a little bit here, and then we're going to bake it in the oven. All right? And I'm not going to put it on both sides, but I believe you can put it on both sides. Okay? You can like put it on both you, sides. I like how you do it. Then. It just depends on, it just really depends on what kind of pan you're baking it in. Because if you're baking it on certain pans, it, you have to turn it. Make sure you turn it over. That's all you have to do. Just make sure you turn it over. I'm just going to put it on one side, guys. But you can definitely put it on both um, and do it like that. It just depends on what you want to do. And I got this idea because when we used to buy those garlic things at the store, the garlic butters and things like that at the store all the time, and we was buying them at the store, we were um, we was buying them at the store, and when we would buy them at the store, they would look just like this. The butter would look just like this, wouldn't it, babe? Yes, it would. What happened? I accidentally got it. Oh, go to the back of the Google, the Google folder. Oh. Okay, um, thank you, baby. fine. So I, I was like, this looks just like this. You're fine. It's, it looks just like this. I'm seeing the butter look. I'm seeing some um, bait. What is it called, bait? I'm seeing some parsley. I'm seeing the green in there. So it must be that. It must be parsley they're putting in there. Yep. So I said, yeah, let me make my own. own. Yep. And it tastes way better. Yeah, so I'm like, let me just make our own, y'all. Okay, good night, sis doorbell. Get you some rest because you gotta go live in a little bit. You gotta go live, sis doorbell. We gotta be up with you to go live with you. So we got some fun. Hey, how you doing, KJs? Welcome in. How you doing? I was in your lives earlier today catching you in there. Well, I wasn't catching you in there, but I was in there showing some love. Oh, my wife was about to die. I need to put some juice on it in a minute. Okay, so I'm getting these butters. I'm over here making up a little bit of this here. Yeah, it's getting them all buttered up. Yeah, this is her thing right here, y'all. I love her. I love her garlic bread. It tastes so good. I love it. Okay. Yes. How you doing, KJs? We're doing great. Oh, you saw me? Okay, you saw me in there. Okay. I was trying to give you some love because we had a busy day. We was helping my mom. She's had surgery, so we we're trying to help her. And then we were over trying to also. Um, we we're at church today, so we had a pretty busy day. So we're trying to catch everybody that we could catch in the meantime. Yes. Yes, Brittany. I don't know if you'd be up and I don't know if you're still here or not. But like we said, we have um, we go live at 11 o'clock at night at 11 p.m. nightly Eastern time. And usually we get a nice crowd in here. Mm -hmm. And if you're looking to get more family members, you can come back at that time. We usually get anywhere from 80 to 100 uh people in our uh, lives thank thank god and if you're looking to get more family members you can come back then and connect with a few people tomorrow if you like or later today or later on today i keep saying tomorrow guys because that's my tomorrow lord you still here lord <laughs> yes lord he said yes, yes lord, lord. <laughs> you still here lord we almost done with this bread guys we're yeah. here Making up this garlic bread, y'all got yeah. a, a garlic butter spread. Mm, just doing an early morning, some live, some different and nibble on you guys. We um, like we said, we're a night owl, so this is like our our dinner slash breakfast at seven o'clock <laughs> in the morning, and we haven't eaten yet. No, and I so this is where we about to get ready to eat now, and mm -hmm. then we'll eat and watch us a little television, and then mm -hmm. we'll probably be sleep probably about. Nine, probably, I'll say. Mm -hmm. Since it's seven now, we'll probably be asleep. That's about it. He said, have you guys been to bed? No, Yvonne, we haven't been to bed yet. Hey, Yvonne, we love you. No, we haven't been to bed. You better get something to eat, and then we're going to hit the sack, Yvonne. Yes, we are. Girl. How you doing, Yvonne? We love you. Very much so, Yvonne. And I'm about to edit a video, so video's coming soon. Um, I don't know how long it's going to take to upload. It'll probably take about, maybe about 20 or 30 minutes to upload. So new videos coming, new cooking videos coming up soon. So you guys will be able to see that. 
Okay. And we appreciate you all for being here. This is crazy. Early in the morning, a lot of people are here uh, for this early morning. People have been coming and hanging out with us. Oh, amazing. Oh, my goodness, guys. So, yes, I'm done with that. I'm going to scrape the rest of this butter so it don't go to waste or anything like that. Okay, so I'm just scraping it off. I like to do a little thin layer. It doesn't have to be a heavy layer of garlic butter on that bread, y'all. Okay. But it's really, really good, y'all. Okay, so let me just go ahead and rub it all on there, hook it up. Okay, so there we go. This is what it looks like, and I'm going to put this in the oven, guys, for about what, about five or so minutes, babe? About five to seven minutes, guys. He said, Joe, where, where are, Joe, where are what? Where's the spaghetti? Is that what you're looking at? Okay, so I'm making my own garlic butter, too. I buy French bread. Yep, exactly. I like the French bread as well. But we didn't have any French bread. And we, mm -mm. I wasn't thinking about making this at all. I'm yeah, saying, so said, we babe. just end up doing this. Yep. So Patty said, where are the what? Spaghetti, Patty? Yeah, it's on the stove. It's on the stove, Patty, but it goes. I'm going to put this in, babe. For about seven minutes. I'm going to do five to see how it comes out, guys. And then we'll see exactly We'll plate it, and y'all can see exactly what it looks like for those who gonna still be here. Cause I know it's really late, you guys. Let me get back onto the screen so y'all can see us a little bit. Yeah, so I love to make my own uh, garlic sauce. What was it called? <laughs> garlic butter. You said love you too. I'm going to text you what I have done. Oh, please. Thank you so much. Tell me what you think. Oh, okay. I sure will, Yvonne. Okay. It looks yummy, Patty said. It looks yummy. Did you even get to show what it looked like? It look and I'm going to make it all up on a plate, Patty, so you can see Honestly, it guys, I thought I was going to get a little more of it. Oh, yeah. That was yours, though, wasn't it? No, it's okay, guys. I'm sorry, baby. Forgive me. <laughs> Forgive me. I'm over here starving, Lord. He done ate up. <laughs> he done ate. No, God, he done ate up the Getty. I thought I was getting a small spoonful. There's plenty over here. No, no, no. I got a pot full, yo. My belly growling. He done ate in front of me. This is the second time he's done this, okay? We was at my mom's house. He did the same thing. Sucked down a bowl of spaghetti right in front of me. Then said, oh, honey, would you like a bite? Would you care for a small... A small Girl, she used to be doing it all the time. That's all it is. Like it when a pot in the kitchen. She used to be... Exactly. I'm used to you doing that because you always told me to do that. You always was like, oh, babe. So I always share with you, so... I figured you would do the same thing. It was that little eye. That little eye. I'm so used to seeing that little eye for years, y'all. That little eye is hilarious. That little eye. Oh, my goodness. That little eye is hilarious. Well, he's sleepy. <laughs> you that crazy, y'all. <laughs> this is what he do when he gets sleepy, y'all. Oh, my goodness. Here I go. Here go the faces, y'all. Y'all get to see the craziness. Random. But you over there, random. <laughs> random. Oh, my Lord. You over there, random. Mm -mm. Random. Hey, the nephew over there. Hey, nephew. Mm -mm -mm. Where you at there, random? Oh, my goodness. Oh, la, yeah. la, la. Random. Where you at? You in there? Mm -mm. Random. You in there, random? Lord. You in there, random? Lord. Lord, yo. Lord, random. Mm -mm. Random. Lord. Mm -mm. That's my husband, Patty, what time do you have to be to work? Where are you driving there now while you're talking? Patty probably on the job. We know Patty. Oh, yeah, she probably at work already. Patty on the job talking. Ram said, yes, Lord. Ram said, what are you doing? Uncle, Uncle Nephew slash Mr. Random. You got some new videos coming out? Random, what you doing up this early? You ain't been to Big Eddie's a lot? Are you off tomorrow too? I know you're off to the twentieth. Who's on? Random. Oh yeah, yeah. So you just you just chilling? I know you're off to the twentieth, but I thought what time you where uh I know you told me you was off to the twentieth. I'm gonna text you later on. I'll text you later on. But I was saying what I, I was saying, like, what you doing up? I thought y'all was sleeping. Mm -hmm. Let's get some rest. What you just throwing up kicking it? Uncle Nephew, what time Uncle Nephew went home? Uncle Nephew was going crazy on everybody today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> then, Uncle Nephew was mad. Mm -hmm. They made Uncle Nephew mad. Uncle Nephew was crazy. <laughs> Uncle Nephew was mad. Then he preached to it. I think he got mad. 
I go nephew crazy. <laughs> hey, but he was preaching some real stuff though. You can tell you've been around the corner and back because he's preaching some real stuff. Mm -hmm. It would. If you really, if you really knew what you know, what I'm saying, if you really knew the Bible, you would know he was really preaching some real stuff. A patty said, "Hey, I work remote. Thank the Lord." Oh, okay. You said you always sacrificing for Joe Dana. Dana, what's that patty wow. said? Dana? CJ what's that patty? Oh, there you go, CJ. I know. Uh, CJ, you see that? You see how you do me? And we're supposed to be like that. She don't even give you no uh no intro and then I give you an intro when you enter the building. You didn't get one today. You get one. Lot of the time. Yeah, I'm saying that. CJ Spicy. Wicked, 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 wicked. There you go. There you go. Exactly. There you go. Right, yeah. Patty and CJ, they both understand that I began starved. They know this every single time they see me. Lord, Lord, Lord. Okay, you said hello about six. You said about six. What? You, what about six? Nephew. I think they took nephew on. How about six? Yeah. Okay. No, nah, okay, it was about six y'all time, seven our time. God, but to say, I seen yeah, y'all. I'm like, y'all went back on six our time. It was like six sixteen. Y'all yeah, back on again. on it. I seen y'all back on again. Well, my phone was about to die. We just come from church. Yeah, but it was like what? We look at the notification. See, I was on there. Oh, look at y'all on there doing what y'all do. Patty said nephew trying to hook up with Pink the other night. It was wild. Nephew <laughs> 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 crazy, y'all. Mm -hmm. No, you ain't Patty. You ain't met the real Uncle Nephew. No, no, no. You, <laughs> the mm -hmm. real Uncle Nephew, crazy man. <laughs> mm -hmm. The real Uncle Nephew, man, you rolling. Mm -hmm. yeah, Today, yeah, Kiki ready to fight, Lord. Yeah, he said that. Kiki ready to fight. <laughs> and, and Mama Search. That ain't funny, Lord. Your mm -hmm. bread is enough. You can't do what's the name on it? Uh, transfer from over here. You know what I'm saying? You can't you use the it. account. Oh no, because that's mobile and that's it. Never mind, that's mobile. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I forgot about that. I was like, man, you could do both. You can have mobile. That's mobile. What does it say? Two ninety nine for something. Yeah, I'm trying to see what, what this is. They got they switch the whole thing over. They switch the whole thing over. Let's see. So far, payment, payment, payment. Payment, payment, uh, arrangement. They got, they got some good stuff over here. Okay, a little bit longer. I might have to put my hair on. Yeah, I was thinking that when you were doing that. Oh, you did? Why didn't you say nothing? I, it was weird because it was so thick. I might, I need to just took it a little longer. It could be a little browner. Yeah, you just took it longer. You're a cut. Mm -hmm. yeah, so I turned over on the other side. Yep. So I turned on the other side now, then? Is the bottom brown already? It's not all the way brown. I'm sorry. Slightly, a little bit. Like, just let it cook a little longer and turn over. Yeah, let it cook a little longer yeah, and turn over. A couple more minutes. Two minutes. Yeah. Talk, 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 talk. You two said minutes. I saw him slobbering over Kiki one time. One time. No, you, yeah, you seen Mr. Random dressed up as Uncle Nephew. Yeah. But you ain't seen Mr. Random. Got a real uncle named mm -hmm. Nephew. Or is the cousin, right? It's your cousin, right? It's your cousin or that's your uncle. Right. I think that's his cousin. He's like his cousin. Oh, that's his cousin. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think so. But is this like my mom's cousin? Yeah, it's like his cousin. 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 Yeah, it's like and he was like, I'm going to pick up my cousin and nephew. And <laughs> Cause one day he, he don't know I'm going, he don't know I'm recording them. See, cousin, cousin. See? Hey, one day he picked up, he picked up nephew in the car and they went to go get some paint. He told, yeah, it was nephew, that day. That was he that told nephew not to steal out the paint store. Yeah, he said. What are you going to steal? <laughs> he is going to steal some paint. <laughs> <laughs> he said, yeah. I like that video. That was good. I like that. He told me. Nephew not to steal not out the paint though. Yeah, Where are you going to get some, some paint? Editing. He's going to steal some paint, some blue paint. Lord, Lord, Lord. Nephew, nephew, nephew. Oh, he said, in New Orleans, it's a lawnmower man. Oh, you seen the lawnmower man? Oh, so she was saying. Oh, she did. He was saying, Patty was there then. 
Hey, say you talking about the new the, the line? Yeah, you were there, Patty. I forgot that was a making me. Oh yeah! Oh my goodness, that was a making me la la yeah, la. Making me la la la. <laughs> Mr. Randall gonna have to put a uh, one of them little sensor things over. <laughs> I'll go. <laughs> a little sensor. You gotta do some editing. <laughs> 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 uh, that people go crazy. And then we're gonna have to put a little comparator parental advisor there. <laughs> Oh my goodness! Oh man! Oh my goodness! He has some. He has. He was. He is drinking some brew and letting it roll. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was drinking. Oh some, my goodness! He was drinking some brew. Love, yeah, love, love. Nephew was drinking some brew today too. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Nephew, had him one of them tall cans. Oh man! Oh, Mr. Randall cracking up. Mr. Randall cracking up. Thanks again for that love as well, Mr. Randall. That was very sweet of you. He had one of them tall cans. Turnover or do? Man, he had one of them tall cans. Yeah. Last, I was wondering why. I'm like, this usually don't be that much. Usually it will. Yeah, it'll make like a whole loaf of bread just about. But it was. It was because I should have softened it a little bit more. Yes. That was my, that was my fault. It's all good. It'll be good. It's all, this one's still be good, guys. Oh yeah. I'm just ready. To, I'm ready to dig in though. We gotta do. We gotta heat oh, the shit. spaghetti up a little bit, or we gotta. I don't know. It's yeah, hot. I'm just trying because I'm ready to play. Yeah, go ahead. I'm star line. Go ahead. Alright, y'all know I'm starting. We're making all day, y'all. Okay. All right, I might be some pasta pudding. I'm trying to some favorite plates, y'all. I'm gonna try to wash some dishes. Okay. They probably got them over here. Yeah, I hope it's some love, Lord. Love, love, love. Yes, love. We don't gotta wash no dishes. Hey, y'all, we're gonna do dishes, though. Yeah. We're gonna do we dishes, Lord. Right? Seven zero does dishes, but yeah, at the same time, we're gonna leave out, huh? Lord. Lord, we're gonna do none of that. We're gonna do. We appreciate that, Lord. Show the buddy, Lord. Show the buddy, Nancy. <laughs> Nephew, she's showing her booty, Patty. We that you, Patty? She's showing her booty, Patty. Oh my goodness! Somebody help me, please. I'm gonna do this guy right here. Lord, Lord, Lord. Oh my goodness, crazy. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I was just cracking up watching uh, Mr. Random. He was cracking up laughing. Uncle Nephew was making Mr. Random laugh. And Oh, so like this is good for you, or you want me to have this for me? This is you lot. <laughs> Every you lot. <laughs> Elsie, that's a place for getting lot. Oh my goodness! This is where I am, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Uh, this is too early for this. Now, broke wrong. Been talking about twelve. <laughs> I know. I've been. I've been right with you. We've been talking for eighty hours on this line, lot. I'm just stuck on burning. What's that? What that wasn't in there? Mm -hmm. You know what that wasn't in there? La la la. Y'all seen it? You yeah. said something to suck, man. Oh, right, let's get rid of it. Let's get it. La la la. Seriously, I'm gonna come on. La la la. Patty said, hey, Mr. Random, roll on the floor. <laughs> Tootsie's here. Hey, Tootsie. Hey, Tootsie Rolling Stones. Tootsie. Tootsie. Oh, my God. Y'all still going? I just woke up. <laughs> Tootsie. We've we been on for like eight hours, Tootsie. <laughs> Tootsie. We eating dinner. Tootsie, we eating dinner now, Tootsie. <laughs> Tootsie. Tootsie. Hey, Tootsie. <laughs> Tootsie. We eating dinner now, Tootsie. He loves saying that. He loves saying Tootsie. He loves saying Tootsie. Like, that's like Mr. Randall loves saying Mama Tootsie. He loves saying Tootsie. <laughs> hey, Mama. That name funny. You always say Tootsie. <laughs> hey, Randall, you he say, hey, Mama. That name funny. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to burn the bread. Y'all sleepy, Lord. I'm going to burn the bread online. <laughs> I'm going to put that. I think I'm burning bread. Lord, Lord, Lord. Okay, I didn't burn it. We're safe. Lord, I'm sleepy, y'all. Uh. Lord, Lord, Lord. We're trying to have enough, Jesus. Uh. Hey, hey, Randall. Hey, hey, Mama. All right, guys. So we got some bread. 
And we got some who's this coming? Spaghetti. Tonight, or not tonight, this morning. <laughs> Oh, look at my mind just twisted. La, la, la. <laughs> okay, guys, so we got our bread and we got we got our bread and we got our what's this called again? Spaghetti. See that right there, Lord? Look at that. Fresh garlic bread, Lord. Look at that. Fresh garlic bread, Lord. So we got the garlic bread. We'll throw a couple of those on the side of the plate. Right there. Right there. Like so. You got something to look like that? Y'all, and this is what the plate turned out to look like, y'all. Look at that. Look at that there. Fit for, fit for a queen. Look at that. <laughs> right there. Oh my god. We we need our taste of uh Uncle Nephew Daily. Yeah. Mr. Randy doesn't go live, so sometimes uh Joe will channel his uh <laughs> his inner <laughs> I'll be channel my inner nephew. Because we need Mr. Randy to go live daily so we can get our daily laugh in, but since Mr. Randy didn't get to go live, Joe began to <laughs> channel his inner <laughs> Oh my god, since you're about to make coffee, I'm glad you're on. I can watch while I get ready. Oh. Lord, I'm about to get off. <laughs> Lord. We're, about We're about to roll some stones tonight. Something <laughs> <laughs> we go. I'm about to be gone, y'all. It's over. Oh my it's over, y'all. Y'all hey, look y'all just hit the button and run away from the computer. No, no, no. Because he's about to leave me if I sit here and boss. I show sure him. She ain't about to do that. She about to get off oh, this computer. Man, this man blow, 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 blow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, video, Lord. I thought it was one, Oh my goodness. Okay, so everybody said looks delicious. Thank y'all so much for the love. Yeah. Everybody says good. You can watch the replay. Okay, so see, watch the replay because you don't love it. It's great. Got a little spaghetti and a little bit of uh garlic. We're probably gonna start doing this though after we get up because we always eat anyway. Thank you so much. He said it looks good. <laughs> good. Good. That looks good, good. <laughs> what time are you coming on tonight? Okay, so we got a 5 30 Eastern time, which is gonna be our craft session. I'm working on a new project, so I'll be there with my craft on. And that's 5 30 Eastern. And then we're going to be doing 11 30 Eastern for the regular growing, crafting, laughing. That's it. So, but we might be doing this cooking thing. So, Ra Random, you going to uh, open up your subscribers so we can put you up there, or you just want to drop your link? You tell me. Text me or something. Tell yeah. me what you want to do. Mm -hmm. You want to put yourself up on the screen, or you just want to drop You just want to drop your link? Because yeah, if you want to put the screen now. If you want, I want to put you up on the screen, but you got to open up your subscribers. If not, open you can't see Open up for a few them. minutes, and then we put you up there, and then close it back up again. Because I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. But it seems like every time you reach new numbers, I'm going to go up and down. Man, y'all cutting up quick for five meals. Yeah. That's how we be doing. Little quick, little quick meals. That's what we said we're probably going to be doing, like... Every so often, that's what we do after we leave. Y'all be like, what y'all be doing after we get done? Gotta find something to eat. And Joe being there making that quick stuff up. So yeah, I'll be in here cooking. Make up something quick, and we figure we might as well chill with you guys while we're doing it. Oh, excuse me, guys. This, this tank is in the way. Baby, just cook, yeah. I'm not, I just make some. <laughs> why are we doing me like that, y'all? Why are talking about me? Why are we be cooking like that? Why are we I ain't always be roasting me. I was like, they just cook, y'all. Y'all just seen something that nobody goes. <laughs> no, no, that's me. She cook, y'all. I made some bread. I'm proud of you, man. You coming out this year? Whatever. Uh, <laughs> Does anybody like to put a little spaghetti on top of their garden? No, we about to get off here. Ain't nobody gonna like to do nothing. We about to get off here. You stop asking any questions. It's time to go, Lord. All right, y'all. Well, we about to get off here, y'all. I love y'all. We'll see y'all tomorrow at the 530 Making Me. Mm -hmm. And we love y'all very, very much. And we will see y'all tomorrow. We love okay? it. Yeah. Later on, Ms. Uncle Daphne, Mr. Ramner. No, you're not about to talk about nothing. He said he's going to show us stuff. Tell us, tell us, tell us, make sure he shows stuff tonight so we can put them up there so we can oh, watch the numbers roll up and then you can always close them back up. Okay, guys. Thank y'all for coming and hanging out with us. We had an awesome time. We're about to go eat and then hit the sack. Love y'all. Sleep tight and let the bed books bite or wake up, have your coffee, enjoy your day. And uh, we'll see you guys a little bit later. Love y'all. See you later.